Well, family, turkey, football. Those are some of the staples of Thanksgiving Day. And the football part of that equation, we have that covered here in Alabama, that's for sure. Fans are already at the capstone gearing up for the Iron Bowl, and that's where we find CBS 42 News reporter Sarah Canty. And Sarah, uh, by the looks of all that oil and fryer behind you, have you taken part in any turkey yet? You know what this is for, Jamie. They have all of this ready to go. They're going to be frying turkeys in a few hours. They have nine turkeys here at this setup in the Northington lot for about 20 to 30 people. Now, I want to show you something really special. A gentleman is here actually from Colorado, and he brought with him an elk, and he is going to be roasting it today. He got up around 430 this morning. It smells so good in here. I want to bring Will as close as we can to see this right here. This is an elk roast right now. It is going to be roasting for the next about eight hours. And no matter who you are rooting for in this game, whether it's Alabama or Auburn, all fans can agree that they want both teams to do well leading up to the Iron Bowl. When one team's down and the other one's not, uh, is up, it's still a good game because you can't predict the Auburn and Alabama game. It is so much emotion there between the players, knowing each other, played high school together, that they're going to give it all. I don't care how bad or how good the records are. Now, one thing to be thankful for, spending time with family and friends, and of course, about 100,000 of your extended family for the Iron Bowl on Saturday. And just another note, that game is Saturday at 2.30, and you can watch it right here on CBS 42. Live in Tuscaloosa, Sarah Canty, CBS 42 News.